it turns out that one of the regions of Pluto, which is a bit of the area that, that looks a bit like a heart in the earlier images, if you've been following this over the last few days, uh, actually turns out to be, well, smoothed over and has, but has these enormously high mountains on it. And it suggests that they're 11,000 feet high. It suggests that it's really a very active world. And that's perhaps slightly surprising because it's way out in the depths of the solar system. It's not very big. It's significantly smaller than our moon, which is very inactive. So it implies that there's some kind of internal process going on that, you know, they think these are made of ice, but there's some heat source inside, perhaps a radioactive core, which is what heats up the interior of the Earth. And that's making somehow the ice turn to water or turn to gas. I'm not that sure of the process, but they're rising up. And that, that's remarkable. It's, it really is unusual to see something that's resurfaced like this. And you know, I think that really has surprised them. From what I can tell from... Uh, listening to a bit of the press conference and seeing the reactions of the team, it, it looks like they're really very, very surprised by that. There's also uh, images of uh, the moon Charon, which is um, a third of the size of uh, Pluto. It's huge, or even half as big. Uh, so it's more like a double planet, Pluto and Charon together. Um, and that actually has a very rugged terrain as well, and the, the impression is that may be an active world too. It doesn't have very many craters on it, and if you compare that with, say, our own moon, you'll, you know, you'll see how moons tend to be peppered with things. So the impression is that perhaps there's a lot of ice there that's smoothing over too, and that there's some activity. And it's got a really incredible feature, a very, very deep canyon, much deeper than the Grand Canyon on Earth, perhaps four or five times as deep over on one side. And there's a big sort of what looks like a crack to the feature going along there as well. So it looks like it's been through quite a battered time and that to some extent those processes are still going on.